Greetings and welcome to the Astronomy Picture of the Day podcast. Today's picture for December 26th of 2025 is titled 3 I Atlas Flyby. So, what do we see here? Well, here we see an image of the interstellar comet known as 3I Atlas. And this was imaged back on December 15th when it was passing through the constellation of Leo. Now, on December 15th, that's just a few days before it made its closest approach to Earth. However, its closest approach wasn't near by most standards, and it was almost two astronomical units away from Earth at that time, or about twice the Earth-Sun distance. So, never came anywhere near Earth on its trip out of the solar system. So, 3I Atlas is what is known as an interstellar object, and in fact a visitor from another solar system that happened to pass through ours. And as it passed near the sun, it warmed up the ices, which had been frozen for mil many millions of years, and vaporized a lot of that material. And that's what we see is the greenish glow around the head of the comet there. In fact, the nucleus of the comet is completely invisible, and we were unable to see it because of all the material around it. And in addition, it would be relatively small. We would not be able to see something like that, certainly not over such a large distance. Distance. Cometary nuclei tend to be very small and are not easy to see. What we usually see is the icy material that has then been vaporized and forms a halo around and then a tail pushing back from the comet, which is what we see here. So, this interstellar comet behaved much like any other comet within our solar system. The big difference was the orbit, and in fact, the orbital velocity traveling at 64 kilometers per second is much too fast for the sun to be able to hold on to. So, it came in, passed by our sun, passed by several planets, again, nothing super close, and is now on its way out of the solar system. And there is nothing that's going to be able to stop it. There is not sufficient gravity. If the sun cannot slow that down, nothing else is going to slow it down. So, it's just passing through, visiting our solar system and then heading back out to interstellar space again, where it will likely remain for millions or even a billion years. Perhaps at some point in the distant future, it'll pass through some other star system, as perhaps material from our solar system has passed through other solar systems off in the distance. So material is often ejected, and in fact, some of the larger planets can do this, and early on in our history of our solar system, Jupiter threw a lot of comets out into interstellar space. Some things that came just a little bit too close to Jupiter, not close enough to crash into it, but close enough to gain enough energy to be able to escape from our solar system altogether. And that's what 3I Atlas did some unknown amount of time ago when it left its distant star system to head towards ours. So that was our picture of the day for December 26th of 2025. It was titled 3I Atlas Flyby. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be Apollo's moonship. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.